Ah, see? Davy, that's why we're such great friends, huh? Because we're old school. We like old-fashioned things. Newspapers. Celluloid. Good guys, bad guys. We're friends? Well, I don't know. You tell me. We did what you said, right? Got those people off your back? Now you're gonna do like you said and cut me loose, right? Things are not gonna work out quite that way. There's a bit of a problem. That's right, Davy boy, you could say that. Steve, I told you I would handle oh, this. Oh, because you've handled everything so fucking well so far, haven't you? All right, I admit things have been a little unorthodox, I'm but- I'm fucking orthodox! You've ruined my career! Agent Sanchez, arrest these men, both oh, of them. Steve, oh, Steve, whoa! On, please. You fucking kidding me? Arrest me for what? For multiple counts of every fucking crime under the fucking sun. Oh, well, then let me rephrase. Why? Why? Because. Because you don't want me to testify in court about our various business dealings, right? Agent Sanchez, apprehend the suspect! Agent Sanchez, you'll do no such thing. Now, Steve, we agreed to speak to Michael, to try and explain things to him, not this. This causes problems for us all. Okay, okay. Then put your gun down and we'll talk. After you, buddy. Come on, where's the trust? You can do better than that. They know or think they know that I'm the one that was behind the incident. Uh-huh. And now you want me to clean up your mess again, right? Before I end up at the bottom of the ocean. Fucking good luck with that. Put the weapons down, boys. Fun time is over. We've got you. Anti-American activity. Put your weapons down, all of you. Who the fuck are you with? The thing. You fucking rat. I knew you didn't have the balls for this. For the record, I'm a patriot. I love my country. Put the weapons down. Fuck you. We all know you agency boys are ball deep in a plot to drive up your funding by any means necessary. Put the gun down, gentlemen. Who the fuck are they? Fucking Merriweather. What are they doing here? Steve, put your gun down. Oh, same goddamn leg. Go! Fuck! Bullshit. Come on! Mike, this your frequency. That's all right. I ain't going anywhere, Davy, until some more of these guys kill each other! What happened to Haynes? He get caught in the crossfire? here for the opportunity. Now run! Touching reunion and all, but I'm about to get jumped by a team of rogue agents. Hey, you got the vantage point. Give Dave a hand. This is the guy who iced Brad and would ice me? I'd be better off putting my sights on him. Haynes made it out of here, and there's another group of agents looking into our shit. Right now, they're not in a position to let our only friend in the bureau get killed. Each other already. They're coming up the Moultrie building. So tell me, Davy, 
Who are these Bureau men trying to kill me? They're a corrupt division. Gone rogue or on the IAA payroll. Look out! Up there! How did you get in this pickle? Jesus! Another murder with a chopper? How big is their budget? Someone's gotta bring down the buzzer before it blows us up! I thought you were the corrupt division. Corrupt? How many paid soldiers these guys got? What happens to Hayes? Norton gonna pop him at the water cooler on Monday? I'm not popping Steve. Jesus. I'll get close to him and I'll try to control him. That's if we get out of here alive. Merryweather Bird is down. Leave me alone. Okay? What are Merryweather doing at this party? You tell me. You're the one hitting their planes, trains, and boats. Just trying to earn a dime. Well, your dime put us on their radar, and I don't know how we're gonna get off it. You're covering me, T! I'm between the fountain and the reflecting pool. Come on! Another chopper! You, don't you know, huh? Yeah, well, maybe it's got a little something to do with being caught in the middle of a three-way firefight between two government agencies and a private militia. You know, it gets me a little stressed out. Okay, but we still need you alive, Mikey boy. I mean, you know, at least for now. Unless, of course, you have another surprise for me. Huh? Maybe something to do with another inappropriate friendship? Yeah, that wasn't exactly Dave's fault. No, no, no. He's just the friendly face of a corrupt government agency looking to further his career by dealing with an equally corrupt and full to the fucking brim with bullshit low-rent hood. Listen, Trevor. Listen. I've been meaning... Uh, you know, I've been meaning... 
I've been meaning to tell you, you know, I mean, what, homie, what are you even meaning to tell me, huh? That you stabbed me in the back, or that you were, and always will be, a worthless wretch who deserves to be put under. Yeah, well, what Clear the fuck did you come day. back for? Oh, you know why. Ah, oh, no, no, no. One last score. Mm-hmm. And if it goes good, <laughs> guess what? I don't have to put a little bullet in your head, but... If it goes bad, well, that's okay, too. Because then, you and I get to go to hell. And I get to spend the rest of eternity with you, tormenting you. Well, I guess it's on, then. Yeah, I guess it is. Call Lester, let's go. On speakerphone. Hey, it's me. I know. How'd it go? Just fabulous. Ran into an old friend. Matter of fact, he saved my ass. Ooh, we're all friends now. Suppose the group hugs out of the question? <laughs> He wants to, uh, still go on the final victory tour. All right, when it looks like it's a go, I'll contact you. And remember this, gentlemen. If we pull this off, we will be making history. Sorted, nasty. Depraved history. But history, nonetheless. All right. There, you happy? Fucking thrilled. Don't forget, amigo. Keep my eye on you. Yeah. <laughs>